everyone and welcome back to the crooked man uh where we last left off we were in this hotel and we heard a noise but i was too scared to check it out so now we're gonna check it out hello oh my god is someone there i'm scared right now uh we found the key to room 109, which is over here. So we're going to go in there and see what's up in that room. Right, is this it? 108. So this one. Yeah. I see a shiny. Something on top, but I can't reach it. Let's use the chair. I guess we have to. Oops. Get up there. Wire cutters. I know what that's for. Shelves are empty. Is this empty? Yep. Is the clock stopped? Yep. Okay. Looks like the bathroom. Somebody's playing the piano. I don't really want to find out who, to be honest. Ah, oh, yeah, of course. Okay. Let's. Hey! Oh my god. <laughs> Who's there? You can't just scare people like that, dude. Uh. I'm sorry, I just came in and the piano looks so nice and I so um sorry I yelled at you. I'm not on staff for the hotel or anything. I'm just trespassing. Who are you then? I'm David. Uh, I'm sorta of looking for a guy. Wh what about you? I'm Sissy. C C Sissy. Sissy. Huh? Sissy? Then <laughs> what brings you here? Could be dangerous, you know. I stayed at this hotel once, but I forgot something important, so I came back to get it. I see. Did you find it? No, I'm still looking, but it's just this little box decorated with rubies, but I'm not leaving till I find it. Right, well, again, sorry for shouting. I'll probably leave here, be here a while longer, so I could help you find it. Really? That would be great. Okay, please help. Just do me a favor, too, though. If you see a man about my age, would you tell me? Okay. Uh, I'll be going then. Um, David, you be careful too. Okay. You play the piano pretty well. Man, what am I doing shouting at girls? I feel like the shady one here. Yeah, don't shout at girls. What's wrong with you, sir? Alright, now let's use those wire cutters on this door here. Click. Cut the wire. Alright. Let's go. Uh. Tourists. Gotta love tourists. A notebook. Er, door in room 107 bathroom needs fixing. There's a key on this page. Got the key to 107. A diary. Er, oh. Oh, okay, stop. Four chapters of the book have been mysteriously gone missing. Should you find the pages, please report to the owner. Okay. Trash can full of crumbled paper. What's in it? You gotta be Snoopy. Snoopy. Miscellaneous goods. What does that even mean? Like, what kind of goods? What's this? There's no doorknob. Well, then. Huh? Or something. Is somebody locked in there? I should find some way to open it. I don't know. That sounds like reverse crying. 
You know what I mean? Like, yeah. One of seven. Is this one or seven? Oh, no. This is. Hey! Doorknob. Oh, yeah! Take it! But now I can't open that. Mirror is filthy. The water is grotty brown. Alright, what else is in here? Let's check it out. Empty. Empty. Alright. Well, that was fun. Let's go let out that demon <laughs> in the staff room. Because... We're stupid. <sighs> I see. I see the uh, hatch in the floor over there. This is creepy. Books of the month. Strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Of course. That phone's probably going to ring and scare the crap out of me. Small door which won't open. Doesn't seem to have a lock. Uh. Okay. That tile looks weird. <laughs> yeah. Stop on it. What? Oh my god. There's a ladder. It goes down. Where else? Maybe I should check this out. Alright. Oh, I was going to save first. Uh. Can't. Lighter. Hold on. Let me save before I die. Oh my. Okay. Chairs. Barrels. Miscellaneous goods. Wooden box. Um, okay. Not, not, I'm. I can't even. Big barrels. D Figure crouches on the floor. A are you okay? Where? Oh, where? Where are you locked in here? Um, oh, that's what we look like. Okay. Whoa, whoa. What? Uh, are you okay? Whoa. Ah. Okay. Oh my, that is creepy. That is, so, mm, go, David, 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 go, 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 go. <gasps> oh my God. Shake off. Shake it. Shake it up. Shake it up. Shake it up. Sh 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 shake it up. Oh my god. <laughs> pant. Gasp. Pant. What, what was that? Its neck was all crooked. Can't have been human. It was a crooked man. Am I just going nuts here? That thing. It couldn't have been real. I must just be- STOP DOING THAT, SIR! You literally saw something, and you can't just- Ugh, I feel sick. Throw up in the trash can. I wonder what sissy's up to. Did she find what she came for? That sissy. Throw up in the trash can. I'd rather not. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. That was- that was wrong on so many levels. Okay. Hey girl, I don't, I don't, I don't know where she went. I don't know. Locked. Can I leave? No, I don't want to be here anymore. Sissy. Shishy. Oops. 
I don't know where where she went. Uh, hmm. I feel like that deer's gonna do something, and I'm not about it. Nope. Well, I don't know where to find this girl. Go to the bar. Get a drink. Get a drink. Locked. All right. Maybe I should just smoke a cigarette. Seems like the proper thing to. <gasps> oh my God! Oh, is that sissy? Run, David, run. Library, I bet. Sissy! No. Wow, that scared me. My heart is beating really fast. Sissy! Oh my god. Sis. Oh. Uh. Sissy, what happened? I, I went to the window. The floor gave way. What, what should I do? Jump over, it's dangerous over there. Uh, no, I can't. I'm slipping. And I can't possibly jump that far. I got this big? It's no time for pessimism. It's gonna crumble. Quick, hurry, I'll catch you. Ah! Jump! Wow, that was pretty skilled. Th th that was too close. Are you okay, sissy? Are you hurt? Sissy? So scared. Ah! I was so scared. No more. I, I don't like the dark. Why do I, I... It's okay, sissy. I'm sorry, I know you were scared, but it's fine now. Don't cry. <sighs> I, I'm sorry. I, I was scared and confused. It's alright. I'm glad you're not hurt. Did you find what you were looking for? No, not yet. It wasn't in the room we stayed in. I wonder where it could be must be important if you're looking all alone. You can always give up, just give up on it. It's not entirely safe here. I, I can't give up on it. I have to find it. What exactly is it? Sorry to ask, but I've just been wondering. Was it a present, or... It's a present for my boyfriend. It's the most important thing to me, after my own life. Ah, oh, I see. Sorry if I was rude. I'll keep looking for it, too. You're looking for someone, right? I haven't met anyone yet, but can you tell me more about them? Uh, well, I don't know that much either. Just that he's a man about my age. Huh? You know that little? About a person you're looking for? <laughs> you're a strange guy, David. I, I am not. There's just some things I want to ask. And I don't know how he looks because, uh... It's strange, but very kind. I would have been hurt badly if it weren't for you. You saved my life. I should get going. Take care, David. I'll see you. Okay. What the hell? All right, I uh, don't know what to do now. Oop. I really like don't know where to look. Get down. Uh, is this? I 
This is one of seven. Yeah. I guess I could go, like, get that knob from the... Or try and figure out this. Locked with a passcode. I have no idea what the passcode could be, though. But, um, maybe it's in here? In this little di book diary thing? Four chapters, is it? Basement door. Oh, fuck. Um... Close it. Why would I even... I'm dumb. See a shiny. Crooked man's gone. Saving because you never know. And what did I get? Bronze key. <sighs> Can I like shut it now? All right. Wait, what is that? So I guess I have to try and find where this key goes now. Let's go here. No. There. Already been in here. There. 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 No. There. Usually when it was for a room, it said, like, the room key for whatever. But I'm just making sure. You never know in this game. I think that's... That's where Sissy fell. Almost fell. Okay. I don't know. Keep feeling like that moose head's gonna do something. Maybe it's to the bar. Yay! I can finally get that drink. Um mostly empty. All right. Hello. Empty beer bottle. Empty beer bottle. Oh, fool. Take one brandy. Catch fire? Why? I don't understand. Oh, the book. Seemingly written by a staff member. Last page is rambling and sloppily written. 
A toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We drank all the beer. We'll drink all the beer we've got. Hell, it's the only good thing here. Being out of a job's no good, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We're so sick of that egghead always trying to flaunt his intelligence. Installing weird stuff for the basement door, having a numbered lock on the food storage, it was silly crap make the place impossible to run. Plus, the passcode was this thing with a book which he changed up every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? It's good for him, but... <laughs> ah, whatever. Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. Toast to our bright futures. The door to the food storage is at the far end of the first floor, right? Passcode on food is pretty crazy. Yeah, you're telling me. Alright, we gotta stop. Um, it's been 20 minutes, so. Um, I don't know, maybe we could find out what the passcode to the book is, to the, wow, to the room is in our next, uh, playthrough. So, stay tuned for part four, in which we will try and unlock the food storage door. And so, bye guys. If you enjoyed this episode of The Crooked Man, you might also like checking out some of my other RPG playthroughs, such as To the Moon, The Mirror Lied, The Witch's House, Five Days a Stranger, Seven Days a Skeptic, Trilby's Notes, Six Days a Sacrifice, and 1213. Just access these by clicking on the title of the game you would like to see and uh there you go and once again thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next playthrough that i do